viewers, Jenny here, and I'm coming to you with a video basically to show you guys how I moisturize and seal my hair. I will also be showing you guys how all my scalp and how I have achieved this hairstyle for a day. Um, the products that I'll be using are the um, Organo Stimulator Carrot Gold, it's this right here, and also Pampa's Extra Virgin Olive Oil, this right here. So, with that being said, let's get started. Also, you guys, I, um, I use the, um, the Icy Sensation Styling Gel, and it doesn't work for my hair, or maybe it's not what I thought it was for. I'm looking for a styling gel that will sweep my edges, and it as um, some of you may or may not know, I'm 25 weeks post relaxer. So my edges are extremely natural, we can say. Extremely natural. And so they are very coarse. And so I would like them to be slick when I wear my hair in different styles. And so if you have any suggestions on any other styling gel, please let me know because this is not working for me. At least for what I want it to do for now. But this is how I moisturize and seal my hair. And I will also be um, oiling my scalp as well. And I only oil my scalp on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And I also do my wash days on Sunday. So um, I don't do any co-washes yet. I just started my hair journey. Sunday officially. So this is my first week actually moisturizing and filling my hair every night before I go to bed and I oil my scalp Monday. Today is Wednesday. So this will be my second time oiling my scalp. And I will also be oiling on Friday and then I do my wash day on Sunday. So let's get started. I um usually session my hair off. I'm going to do it in what, three sections. Three sections. So I start here. This will be one section. I'm going to put the rest of my hair in like a rubber band or a clip or something. Whatever going to have around that's close to me. But get so many curls out. I like the swings 
of my wrap. That's not the only hairstyle I wear is wrap. But since I started this um, healthy hair journey I'm trying to do, um, I don't wear my hair wrap because I would have to flat iron it for um, 25 weeks to the next year. So my hair is very coarse. I don't know if you can tell. I actually blow dried my hair on Sunday when I washed it, but I haven't flat ironed it. But I have um, blow dried it on medium heat. It wasn't high, it was medium. It wasn't low, it was medium. So I used about a drop of um, the extra virgin olive oil. I'll put it um, on my ends. And then from this point, I would usually roll my hair with the flexi rods. That's how I have achieved the hairstyle that I had earlier in the video. But since all my, um, all my scalp tonight, I'm just going to leave it in its section. And then I'm going to um, section this and this, and I will be back. Okay, I'm back on my last section. And like I said, I'm moisturizing the seal. Then I or my scalp. About that much. Put it on at the end. Just a little bit more. I'm going to say that this carrot oil is not heavy at all. I think it's a good product. I know I've seen other people moisturizing their hair with the um, olive oil lotion, but because I don't like lotion, like I remember back in the day when my mom used to use the pink oil moisturizer, and that was extremely heavy on my hair. And um, I, so when I think of lotions, I think of that. So I just stayed away from that. And then I was, I was gonna um, just get the um, olive oil cream. But when I went to the store, they didn't have the cream, and so I also heard about the carrot oil was a good source for um, a moisturizer. So I just picked that up, and I may say that I'm not disappointed at all, at all, at all. But, okay, after I'm moisturizing still, uh -uh part with my finger and I pulled, I poured some um, olive oil in the cap of the carrot oil just a little to um, oil my scalp with. So I won't be dipping in the bottle and contaminate it even though I'm not going to cook with it just still the thought of it. So uh -uh. part with my finger. You can look rather than some more scat. There's a premature foam massage in the scat.
that being said, something made my hair soft and it was the first time I used both of those products. And right now, I'm not trying to mix any products just yet. I'm just trying to see how each, I need a little bit more, a little bit more oil on the top. But like I was saying, I'm not really mixing any products together because right now I'm trying to figure out what works for my hair because I know some people say coconut fish their scab or dry their scab. This and that, so I'm trying to see if that's the case with me. Um, I think I noticed a little dryness in it, but I always had dry scab. So, by me using this oil to oil my scalp every other day, it's really, I really haven't noticed any inky scab or flakes or anything like that. So, as of now, the products that I have used this week are good for me. I will be giving a review on um, all the products I'm using once I have faithfully used them and gave them a chance to work. So, until then, I'm going to continue to trim and make sure I get an understanding of them all before I actually tell you guys what I think about them. But as of now, everything I've been using has to work for me. So. Okay, that's the end of that. So, finger comb it. Yeah, that's the final look. Like 